Alright guys, what is going on? It is Zion, and I have another COD Ghosts video, get it right this time, um, about all the new maps for Call of Duty Ghosts. So, Ghosts is just around the corner, today is the first, it comes out on the 5th, um, so I will be putting out a lot of videos to do with Call of Duty Ghosts before it comes out, so make sure you're subscribed, stay up to date with what I'm putting out, and also when Ghost does come out, I will be putting a lot more videos out as well. So make sure you're subscribed. If you're getting it for Christmas and you still want to know about it, again, make sure you're subscribed. I will be putting out as much videos as I can when Ghost comes out. I will literally be like staying up as long as I can just to get videos out for you guys. So um, yeah, let's get into the map. So the first map we have is called Freight. Factory Transport Depot cross the tracks to prove who is the dominant competent in this classic style map. Now this map reminds me of cargo or shipment from COD 4 even though this will probably be a lot bigger than shipment because shipment is tiny but um, it has it says about it's a factory transport depot so there could be trucks rolling around there could be forklifts carrying stuff there could be crates um, it says about tracks you need to cross the tracks um, to prove who is the dominant competent in this classic style map so you could need to cross over into the enemy half of the map and try and fight it out, prove who's dominant. Um, I'm not sure, but this does look like a pretty cool map. Um, I'm not sure if it'll be good for... Uh, actually, I'm not sure. It could be like an all-round gun, really, weapon map. So, yeah, next map, let's go. Second, we have Overload. Satellite military outposts control the center in intense domination matches. So this map looks pretty cool. Um, it would be pretty good for snipers I'm guessing because if there's a lot of people running to the main part the middle of the map which it looks like the picture right there that huge satellite could be the middle of the map and everyone's trying to fight over it to control it um, I'm not sure if it will do anything I have no idea because again you have like dy dynamic maps let's get the word right and all the maps move and you'll see further on in this video about earthquakes and stuff but um, yeah this map looks pretty cool and pretty intense by the sounds of it as it does say intense <laughs> next we have siege siege or siege I'm not sure pretty much the same thing anyway abandoned industrial island lots of cover with plenty of spacious sightlines for open style combat this would be a good map for snipers I know I keep talking about snipers but I am a sniper so deal with it <laughs> I'm just joking you do what you want you do what you want but in abandoned industrial island this seems like it's gonna be a pretty big map I have no idea because it does say I think I heard somewhere that COD Ghost maps were going to be a little bit bigger than normal, so that would be pretty cool. And there's lots of cover with plenty of spacious sight lines, so again, obviously snipers, uh, not probably not good for shotguns, um, SMGs, medium probably, and probably main thing, an assault rifle map, but that's just going to be annoying. But yeah, what I'm not even going to say the other one because that's just shit. marksman rifles you could probably be good for that but I'm not even going to say the other one because I hate it as people that don't even know how to play god next map we have this thing is a third map we have sovereign 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 pretty sure that's sovereign couldn't read it then for some reason mine went blank tank assembly plant quick engagements in a turn by turn action pack pace setter so this is probably going to be a close combat map SMG shotguns are going to be running around this map and it's a tank assembly plant so again machinery will probably most probably be moving around there'll be forklifts there'll be obviously that thing that's carrying part of the tank or things coming out the wall that are making tanks so I'm not sure if the game will actually let you walk through it or it's just going to have it shown and then block it off and be boring as shit but um yeah if things are going to be moving around you're going to have to watch your back and your face you don't want to get hit in the face that sucks but yeah so Sovereign, tank assembly plan, quick engagements in a turn by turn action, pack pace setter. It's going to be quick, close combat. So um, anyway, next map we have, if it would just pass over to the next map. Hurry, 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 can't be bothered to change it. Map details, obviously that's not the map. What am I doing? Stonehaven, fight, admist, a ruined castle in the Scottish Highlands. Open layout allows for long distance engagements. I read that like a complete retard. But anyway, that looks pretty cool. Actually, looks like a proper battlefield. I don't know if for some reason it reminds me of Lord of the Rings. I have no idea why, but it just does. So that's going to be a huge open area by the looks of it. And if people camp on the top with snipers hard scoping, if you can actually get on the top, that is. I'm not sure if you could. Um, if you can get on the top of that castle, it'd be pretty cool for like trick shots. But I mean. 
if people are just going to sit up there with tax and hard scope, everyone running towards them, that's just been, it's going to be a ball egg because I don't even know what that was, I messed up my words. But um, yeah, looks pretty cool, reminds me of Lord of the Rings, I have no idea why, but yeah, there you go. Next map we have uh, 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 Stormfront, weather out the storm, vertically mixed with open space crates, intense search and rescue matches. So this reminds me of Drone, I have no idea, you can see it has buildings, because well, that helps, every map has buildings, what am I talking about? You have trees and leaves and the rain and the sky and just something about it reminds me of Drone, okay? So yeah, this looks like an alright map, I hope it isn't like Drone obviously because Drone sucked, don't know who agrees, but I wasn't a fan of Drone so obviously this is probably going to be a bigger map and yeah, rain and stuff so pretty interesting but not really hmm next map we have tremor this this map right here this looks like a cool map in the heart of texas on the edge of an impact crater multi-tiered earth shattering action so this is the map that has earthquakes in so you're going to be running around and then suddenly i don't know why do earthquakes make that they don't even make that noise what am i doing but yeah, um, that was retarded. But you get earthquakes on this map, so you'll be running around, earthquakes gonna happen, shit's gonna fall down, buildings gonna fall on your face, you're gonna lose your lunchbox, you're gonna be pissed because you're hungry, and then it's gonna change the flow of the map, so enemies will have to run different ways, and you have to learn about it, and that's just gonna be crazy. So yeah, that looks cool, my favourite map so far. Um, the next one we have Warhawk, this is the last map in Ghosts, so it's an evacuated town ravaged by mortars. Open streets and tight alleys give a great all-round combat experience. So I know the text is a little dodgy. Looks like your eyes have just gone retarded, but there you go. I read it out. You should, you should be able to read it. It's not that bad. But I believe this map is what Phase Cross played on his video. If you haven't seen it, there's a video that Phase Cross does about sniping on Cod Ghosts, and he actually runs around on this map. I think it's this map because it looks similar. But um, it could be similar to Nuketown because it does say open streets but tight alleys and an evacuated town. And Nuketown's obviously evacuated and there's tight alleys around the sides. Not sure, I hope it's not like Nuketown because that would suck. But yeah, obviously it would be similar but different if you know what I mean. But that's it guys, hope you enjoyed this ghost video. Make sure you're subscribed for every COD, vid COD video I will be posting. I will be posting a lot so... um yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video please leave a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe for videos after cod ghosts and before so we'll be putting out as much as i can Whew, i went through this video as quick as i could even though it's been like eight minutes long but there you go guys i'll see you in the next ghosts video